Hi hey everyone, if Roblox keeps crashing for you on Windows, maybe this is the solution for you. First, we're gonna convert a Microsoft account to local account. So basically, you're gonna sign in to this Windows using a local account instead of Microsoft linked account. So how do we do that? You're gonna find other users in the settings. Actually, it is under accounts and then other users. You can also reach this menu from the settings and then go to account and other users. And then you click on I don't have this person's sign in information. So add user without a Microsoft account. You just gonna type whatever, like K and then one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so once there, you can actually log in with that person's account and then try to install Roblox from there. So if you are currently logged in, you have to log out first and then log in with that person's account. So you go click on that picture of your account and then press sign out. So once you are logged in with that person's account, you can install Roblox as usual, either from the website or from Microsoft Store. Or if this doesn't work for you, then go ahead to try the second option. So the second option that you're going to do is probably you can change the Roblox player installation. There are two options to install Roblox. First is you go to the website and then find Roblox installer, download Roblox, and then download Windows app which is available in EXE format and then you install it from there okay so you have something like this so if you have this as your installation method then uh, you gotta check another version of Roblox which is actually available in the Microsoft Store Roblox is here so you can install it from there okay install it as usual so alternatively you go the other way around so if you first install Roblox from the Microsoft Store you uninstall it first and then you go to Roblox and then you install it from the website instead of the Microsoft Store. So let's say I just gonna simulate this. If it happens that you have the Roblox player that is coming from the website, you gotta uninstall this first. So you go to typical uninstall settings, uninstall that first, uninstall it. Then once uninstalled, yep, it's pretty fast. So that web version has been uninstalled. So you go here to the Microsoft Store and install it from here, right? So it's actually a little bit more advanced because it's connected with Xbox account. So you press download. Yeah, so those are the two solutions that you might want to try out. So go ahead and try Roblox, whether it opens it for you. If you find this video useful, please comment down below and subscribe. Thank you.